Because if you do this, if you come from the bottom, I, I there's going to be a moment in the footage where you can see my junk. And I don't want to. Oh, you talking about the moment where I'm pointing at your junk? I get it. Okay. Okay. We're doing this. How are my levels? How's my hair? Focus tricks, man. Mm, it still works. This is what it's like to vlog. I'm headed to Link's house. So I've invited Rhett over to my house. To take a shower in his shower. There's a particular aspect to my shower that I've been bragging to Rhett about. I want him to come over here and experience it firsthand. There's also a controversy, I guess I'll call it, around the advice that he's been giving me about what I should be doing with the feature that I've been bragging about in my shower. I have already taken a shower in my own shower because I don't know if I can trust his shower, but I won't tell him that. So today, I hope to determine once and for all if his advice was as stupid as I think it was. It's raining. It's not supposed to rain in Southern California. Oh, they have a Christmas scene. Someone's at the door. Good morning. Welcome to my house. It's not like you haven't been here. This is what vlogging is like, Link. This is vlog. This is what a two-man vlog is like. You can't cover up your face with the camera. Ah! Jake, you need to be quiet for a second. We're figuring something out. I'm putting you on the left. And I'm putting you on the right. That works. But your camera's still in front of your face. How about one of these? About to this? the side? Yeah. That might do it. What if we filmed ourselves? Like this. There's like no, that? There's no camera in there. Let's just, let's just do this. This is much easier. It's cover, you're covering your face. You, because I'm trying not to cover your face with your camera. Am I covering my face? Okay, that works. Okay. Can I see your bathroom? Yeah. I've been in Link's house uh, many times, but your your bedroom suite is upstairs, and I typically don't visit your bedroom. Uh, exactly. That's for you and your wife. Here it is. Yeah, this is it, man. This is the bathroom. Look at that. Look around. Is it all that you thought it would be? I see two windows. You get a window for the bathtub. Right. And you got a window for the shower. Um, That's exactly right. It's a nice bathroom. Oh, look at that. You see that? You see how that thing is? Was that because backwards? I hit the switch or is it because I walked towards it? When you walk towards it, it opens up and it beckons. Now yeah. you, you don't have to lift that lid. Push the other button. Oh, Push I the farther left, left button. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, yeah. I, I, I got I got one of these in my house. That's P mode. What happens when you hit the bidet when no one's on it? That's a good question. That's that's a smart toilet. It knows nobody's there. That's not that's not what today's about. When I first moved into this house, before we remodeled this bathroom, the shower was over here, and it did have a window. Now the window was opaque. But what I would do and when I as most shower windows are. Yeah, but I don't get that. What's the point of a window if you can't look at it? The point of an opaque window in a shower. I don't know what I mean. I was a high, it was a rhetorical question. Well, I, there is an answer. Well, it was rhetorical. It lets light in. It was rhetorical. You get the sunlight, but you don't lose privacy. What I would do it's was a privacy window. I would look out the window while I was taking a shower, and when I remodeled, I wanted the shower to have a more panoramic, cinematic view of more of the of the mountain range. So when we redesigned this, I said, I want a window in the shower to remain, even though I'm, I, I encountered resistance all along the way. There's no issue of being seen naked. You don't, there's no issue with seeing anybody's junk or anybody's breasts in this situation. This is definitely a neck up window. But to me, I don't like the idea of being seen at all. Any part of me while I'm naked. Which brings us to the issue. One time, I looked down from the mountains into my neighbor's driveway where he, his car was parked, and I noticed hmm, right there that he was getting in his car. I was like, I was like ducking. I was like, I'm, I'm bathing, I'm shampooing, and I'm like trying to hide myself and see if he can see me. By the end, I was cowering in the corner showering in my own shower. That's no way to be. Then once he left, I'd be down like this and then I'd be peeking, see if he's over there, because he would be right there. That's my neighbor's house. So I'm telling Rhett all of this on the podcast, and then you're saying... Your toilet keeps opening and closing. It's on, I'm, I'm can, we, can we turn it off? Well, you know, there's a button, there's a button to turn it off. 
Uh, that's the flush. Do you know how to turn it off? No, I don't. It's not my toilet. That is the flush. Just unplug it. What I told Link was, you need to lean into this. Now, I tend to think about the inevitable apocalypse. When it really hits the fan in Los Angeles, neighborhoods become tribes, and then you don't want to be subservient in that tribe. You want to be one of the leaders. He this tells is, me to stare down my neighbor while I'm showering. I was like, to assert dominance. Yeah, because if you develop a relationship with your neighbor whereby when he looks at you, you cower in fear, then he's gonna have you on a leash in the apocalypse. You want him on a leash. Are you talking about a, a physical leash? Yeah, people are gonna be carrying around people on leashes in the apocalypse. What I'm saying is, you need to look at him. You need to dominate him. He needs to cower in fear, get into his car and go away. And so, you did that, right? I, I, I did do that. And how did it go? It was hard. It's hard to be a leader. It took a lot of gumption. Mm -hmm. And then when I was doing it, I, I'm, I'm, I don't know for sure that he that he saw me, but I think he did. And he did, I don't know, he just drove off. But he was gonna do that anyway. Have you talked to him since? I haven't talked about this. Like, hey, did, did you notice when I was staring at you in my shower? Well, you wouldn't want to talk to him about that directly. Right. You well, talk about other things. You act as if it never happened. Well, I did that. Good, that's good. Because like we went out of town and like they kept our mail for us. Oh, so you already get him to do your work. Yeah. They're already serving you. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing, I want to know what it feels like to be him when I do what you told me to do in my shower. So I want you to take a shower, Okay. and I want to go into my neighbor's driveway, mm -hmm. be my neighbor, see what it feels like to be him when you're being me doing what you told me to do. You're going to let me do that in, in private? Well, I'm going to film it. Just... You're going to film it from the waist up. Yeah, I want to film your junk. I don't want Ben when he's editing this to see my junk or my or my ass. And neither do I. So when you frame me, I want you to start from the top and I want you to tilt down. Because if you do this, if you come from the bottom, I, I there's going to be a moment in the footage where you can see my junk. I don't want. Oh, you're talking about the moment where I'm pointing at your junk. I get it. Okay. If I'm going to be in there when you're naked, I don't know why I just can't be in there when you're getting naked. You think the act of taking your clothes off is a little more weird yeah, it, yeah, I kind of than like just a, having your clothes like a stripper. off? stripper. I feel like a stripper, you know, now. But I'm just, gonna, in a second, I'm just gonna be a man taking a shower with his best friend filming it. Not weird at all. Okay, I'm in. I'm filming the ceiling. Okay. Well, I thought I was filming the ceiling and it just barely was the ceiling. Up, man. I am tilting up. Let me zoom in. Your shower's too short. First thing I can tell is this. Oh, you got a you have a rain you have a rain thing. Yeah, I got a rain thing, man. First of all, you're gonna want to take. I can figure out a shower. All right, fine. Oh, man. Fine. I stay in hotels all the time. That doesn't do anything. There. Oh, okay. Yeah, it starts off pretty cold. What? What? Yeah, it, it comes out of there first. You told me not to tell you. Don't want to mess up my hair. What else? You got to take advantage of that window. How do you how do you defog the window? You crank it open. Yeah, look at that. I crank this open when I'm in the shower, and then now hold on, you're seven inches shorter than me. Get more my height. Yeah, that that's my height. Yeah, and that's what I mean. See that eye line? That's it, man. That's this is what you see. Okay, so what kind of faces do you make? Do you do the, like those herbal essences commercials? <sighs> If you're gonna do that, I'm gonna film your jump. You don't, do you do that or do you not do I that? don't do that. Okay. Was that lightning? You're not supposed to take a shower when it's lightning. What if I died doing this for you? How would you feel about that? Probably it's lightning. Views. Lightning. The first two man vlog ever suddenly becomes a one man vlog. All right, so you stay here, keep showering. I'm gonna go out there, I guess with a freaking umbrella. And then we're gonna, we can communicate. I think we'll be able to. You might have to out. yell. Pretty sure they're not home. So here's his driveway. Here's his garage. This is where he typically parks. And then over there is is my.
Frustrated. Okay. <laughs> I think he's frustrated. I'm having to work out some sort of a some sort of a rig to keep myself dry. Oh gosh, this is This is hard. There we go. I hope we don't destroy these cameras. One of them's in the rain, the other's in the shower. This rain is a bit frustrating. <laughs> I'm, I'm sitting here trying to hold a freaking... You know what? This is great. You, if we can get through this video with these conditions, man. Two cameras, three cameras, no help. It's raining. If we can do this first video, think about what, how easy the second video is gonna be. So I've gotten on the roof in order to get the best shot that represents what it feels like to be my neighbor in his driveway. That's what it feels like for him when he gets in his car. How's that? Pretty creepy. Why would any neighbor in his right mind while showering stare a guy down when he's just trying to begin his commute? When you have that man on a leash and he's doing your bidding, Okay, at this point, a dude drove up who we put in the video, but then afterward he asked to not be in the video. So we replaced him with a chipmunk. This is the kind of thing that happens when you're doing a two-man vlog. A chipmunk? This shows up when it wants to. You can't tell it to stop. I feel like we should ask the chipmunk what he thinks. Sure. Let's see if I can get a third uh, unbiased opinion from my chipmunk. This is good. Getting an unbiased third party to give their opinion is a really good idea. Hey there, I, get, I could use your help with something. My neighbor can see me showering when he gets in his car to go to work. He's having a conversation with a chipmunk. I'm not party to it. Just stand right here and, and squ squat down a little bit. Yeah, Let me just tell me what you see. I can see the dude just combing his hair. He's grabbing his hand through his hair. Yeah, he's shampooing. Would you say that he's making eye contact with you? Yeah, I, I can tell. <laughs> How does that make you feel? You're about to, you're getting in your car, you're going to work. I just say bye and then leave. So you think it's fine? Yeah, I ain't not saying nothing wrong. Hey, Link! Yeah? Let me try some intimidation techniques. <laughs> okay, he's gonna try some intimidation techniques. You just, just look at him looking at you and tell me what he's doing. He's doing that, the rock eyebrow. Okay. I am meat again. I am the leader of the Highland tribe. You will do my bidding. Well, he looks mad right now. I need you to break into that rundown super Walmart and get me a cooler. <sighs> Two coolers. On a scale of one to 10, how intimidated are you right now when you look at him looking at you? I'm not intimidated at all. He thinks you're not intimidating. <laughs> See, j just to clarify, he's told me when I shower to stare my neighbor down and intimidate him so that when the apocalypse comes, <laughs> I I will have dominance over it. <laughs> You've been tremendously helpful. Yeah, we're well, like really. Thank you, man. Right, okay, so. He was intimidated, right? Uh, no. He, he actually thought that it was an opportunity for a friendly connection. Right, but what, what about when I got into my intimidation techniques? You were saying stuff? Yeah, I was intimidating him. I don't know, man. You're kind of barking up the wrong apocalyptic tree here. If your relationship with your neighbor in the present time before it hits the fan is important. It kind of is. Then maybe you can be nice to him. Maybe you can just do a slight nod and, and a wave. I'm not going to argue with that. But if and when I come back and shower, I will intimidate him. I kind of like to just get out of the rain. I'm almost out of battery. That's something you got to worry about, too. Vloggers, man. I got a lot to think about. Okay, you put on your clothes. Yeah. I dried off a little bit. I, I still don't know what else. I, I don't know what the firm conclusion is, except I think you've just been trying to control me into do some, doing something idiotic. Possibly, but I will say, we did it, man. We made a video without any help. <laughs> Why are we, we're like bent over right yeah, now. Which I mean, I think this is, was your idea. I think this is symbolic. I kind of want to stand like this. This is symbolic of how I feel about how this video went. It's kind of like, okay. I feel great about Okay, that battery died, so now we're And there's only 1% on this battery, so we gotta get this out real fast. Get out what? I don't know, I don't have anything to say now. Subscribe! We're gonna get good at this. I just feel like I need to go take, take another shower. You can leave though. Okay.